Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, one of the beauties of the COVID which we have learned is this Zoom where we can be together from our individual places. But this also have some technical glitches for which being the host, I got cut out. But thank you so much for attending. Uh, good evening, Honorable Minister, Honorable Ambassadors, uh, respected participants, uh, BGCCI members, and respected members of the press. BGCCI is the largest trade body in Bangladesh, uh, a bilateral cha trade chamber, and it is one of the oldest. We take pride in what we do because Bangladesh and Germany, we are the largest trade partner so far as the Bangladesh is concerned, doing nearly $7 billion of trade every year. Now, Bangladesh and Germany have a historical relationship. Uh, Bangladesh got liber liberated in 1971, and uh, from Germany was one of the first countries to recognize us, and we remain grateful as ever. Today, our topic is uh, whether the post-COVID relationship between uh, Germany and Bangladesh, whether it's a prospect and a problem. As we all know that the COVID-19 pandemic has gravely wounded the world economy with the serious consequences impacting all communities and individuals. Moving rapidly across the borders along with principal arteries of global economy, the spread of the virus has benefited from the underlying interconnectedness and frailties of globalization, catapulting a global health crisis into a global economic shock that has hit the most vulnerable the hardest. Emerging from the natural environment and paralyzing our societies and our economies, the coronavirus disease demonstrates the interdependence in implicit in the international trade and how it is derailing global efforts to achieving them. Since the virus has first began to spread and the potential repercussions for development and progress became apparent, we at BGCCI Secretariat have been closely monitoring the effects of the global pandemic on trade and development. This <laughs> webinar, product of this engagement, it synthesizes the substantive analysis and dialogue that BGCCI has undertaken around these issues. It seeks to discern how COVID-19 is sparring on a number of trends already visible prior to this pandemic, magnifying some obstacles, but at the same time, how it is opening up new opportunities for trade and development. While the pandemic may be far from over, and we in Bangladesh just got our vaccine, I think yesterday, it has become clear that transforming global approaches to trade and development cannot be avoided when charting a sustainable course to recovery from the pandemic. We hope this discussion will highlight the prospect for a better economic relation between Bangladesh and Germany. We will try to identify areas where the pandemic is accelerating trends already building up since the global financial crisis in trade, investment, and technological change. It is our belief that this recovery from pandemic can help to reshape the global production network and reset multila multilateral cooperation for the better accelerating the achievement in bilateral trade between Germany and Bangladesh. We believe this recovery can sow seeds of healthier, fairer, and greener globalization than can be nourished by a more resilient approach to trade and growth um, between these two countries. Uh, I thank all of you who have participated here, and I think so far it's going now. We have learned a lot, but uh, we expect that very serious participants and guests are coming, uh, the industry leaders, and we hope to get enlightened from them. Thank you very much. Ambassador Shahadakar, you, you need to unmute. Well, thank you very much. Thank you, President. Well, uh, now I would request our next speaker on my list is Mr. Jean Mortes, Managing Director of Julius Hoopeden GmbH from Germany, a very renowned speaker. You have the floor, sir. Yes.